What's up guys and welcome back to the channel. So August 1st was one hell of a day for Cardi because she finally announced that she's leaving Offset for good. Now at the time she said the reason for filing for divorce was irreconcilable differences but we all know Offset has been cheating on her like his life depends on it and not gonna lie. I think that his cheating ways had a lot to do with Cardi filing for divorce but there are some fans calling Cap with this whole situation. They think it's a publicity stunt. Now this has a lot to do with the blind item that points pointed out the fact that Cardi B was meant to pull this huge PR stunt in the first week of August. So the blind item reads a secret meeting about the Nip Tuck female rapper's album took place this week and her bosses don't think her fans are motivated enough to keep it on the charts. And then they go on to list everything that has happened since Cardi B dropped her first album. And at the very bottom it says, the people who signed her are embarrassed and the moles are talking. That's why she was so rattled this week. A publicity stunt is scheduled for the first week of August. And then they followed up with another blind item yesterday and said, the publicity stunt mentioned in an earlier blind item about the Nip Tuck female rapper Cardi B was right on time. Thanks to her, investment in female rappers is about to dry up because the higher ups at every label are using her career and fans as a case study. The Lotto sounding rapper Lotto is in the same predicament because she can't stay on the charts or tour arenas either. The bosses at Nip Tuck rapper's label are, will cut her budget in half if her second album isn't out by September, and wish they had signed the three-name female rapper Megan Thee Stallion who was shot. Someone at the label mentioned a surprise drop, but her bosses are against it. They are scared that the fans of the currently touring rapper Nicki will organize and embarrass Nip Tuck by buying their face album on the same day. Could you imagine how embarrassing that would be? Cardi B, Lotto, Megan The Stallion. Nicki Minaj fans responded by saying, not gonna lie, I'm calling it the Cardi B offset divorce is a publicity stump for her album and they planned this. There was a blind item that came out earlier this month, I believe, saying that Cardi B was gonna do another publicity stunt the beginning of August. So so I'll believe it when the paperwork is finalized. Let's face it, divorce announcement was just a publicity stunt. Cardi B is not divorcing Offset. Starting to think that she just wants attention and all, and not really wanting to release an album. Now I really want to know what y'all think, because a lot of things that were said in the blind items are coming to pass. The publicity stunt aka her announcing that she is divorcing Offset was right on time in the first week of August. I really feel like she'd be playing in our faces sometimes and she has threatened to leave him way too many times for me to just believe it just like that. I think I speak for many people when I say, we gonna need to see the decree to believe it. But on a lighter note, I do wanna highlight the fact that she finally decided to reveal that she is pregnant with her third child. She shared the news on her Instagram with a caption that read, with every ending comes new beginning. I'm so grateful to have shared this season with you. You have brought me more love, more life, and most of all, renewed my power, reminded me that I can have it all. You've reminded me I never had to choose between life, love, and my passion. I love you so much. I cannot wait for you to witness what you have helped me accomplish, what you pushed me to do. It's so much easier taking life's twists and turns and tests laying down, but you, your brother, and your sister, have shown me why it's worth it to push through. So I really do hope she proves us wrong and actually follows through with it and I pray she stays healthy for her and her kids. I'm gonna leave it at that. So moving on to the next topic, there's this girl that's been going viral on social media talking about how her and her friend had relations with love and Hip Hop Atlanta cast member Scrappy and now her friend is pregnant and intends to keep the child. So what had happened was this girl was talking to Scrappy and they had their own little thing brewing. Y'all know Scrappy is for the streets, right? So yeah, they were vibing and all. And one day this girl decides to pull up on Scrappy with her friend. While they were there, they were having a good time and they decided to take the vibe to a whole other level in the bedroom. And now her friend is pregnant. And despite the fact that Scrappy doesn't want the child, she wants to keep it and she doesn't care about what her friend thinks. So I'm going to play the story time for you guys and I want to know your thoughts on this whole situation and the Cardi situation too. So as always, do let me know your thoughts in the comments down below. Give this video a thumbs up and hit that subscribe button. Catch you in the next one. Put a finger down if you were on a Now That's TV show and you won the show and you and the guy who you won the show with decided that y'all were going to see where things went, date, and potentially get serious. Put another finger down if you were at his house one day 
and decided that you wanted to invite your friend over so we can all get lit. And he tells you to have her Uber to a gas station and you pick her up from the gas station just so she doesn't have his physical address. Put another finger down if y'all were vibing, turning up, getting lit, and y'all all mutually decide to have a And then a month later, after having that three that you brought your friend into, she calls and tells you that she's pregnant and by the guy that you're talking to. Put another finger down if now he's gaslighting you into thinking that it's your fault and you're the cause of this and you need to now handle the situation and talk your friend out of having a baby that he does not want. <laughs> now put another finger down if after having a conversation with her, she decides that she's keeping the baby for sure and there's no talking her out of it. Put another finger down if after y'all both come to the realization that she's keeping the child, he decides to constantly hit you up, making you feel like there is still a potential and chance out of this relationship outside of the fact that you're having a child with my friend. Put a finger down if you was a devil and thought that that was really going to work. 